Okay, let us proceed to the second question. A close by produces a fundamental node at 412 hertz. It is now cut into two pieces of equal length. Calculate the frequency of the fundamental node produced by each piece. Okay, first of all, it is uh, started with a close pipe. Okay, it's a close pipe, produce a fundamental mode. Okay, this is a fundamental mode uh, frequency. And then cut into two pieces of equal length. Yeah, cut. Calculate the frequency, fun, frequency of the fundamental node. Okay. Um, okay, let us start with uh, drawing the diagram. I always draw the diagram. So for the close pipe, for the close pipe, okay, the fundamental mode is like this. Now this is the close pipe. Fundamental mode is like this. A node with empty node. Okay, the close end is a node. The open end is always an empty node. So from here you can see uh, this length is equal to uh, one quarter lambda because the distance between node and empty node is always one quarter lambda. Okay, uh, we can write that down first. Um, the length, the length of the, the length of the pi is one quarter lambda. So this lambda is equal to four l. Okay. Lambda equal to 4L. Now, uh, let's uh, find out this frequency. Uh, he said the fundamental frequency for the closed pipe is 412. Okay, so just use the formula um, V equal to F lambda. So, the frequency is equal to V over lambda. Okay, uh, the fundamental frequency is um, 412. And the lambda given is uh, lambda I got from here is 4L. So just substitute with 4L. Uh, so from here, I got a ratio of V over L. I got a ratio of V over L. Uh, so multiply to the, uh, the 4 multiplied above, I got 1648. Uh, I got this value. This might be useful. Okay, so let us uh, continue. We, yeah, this one we uh, just uh, keep it, keep it first. Now he says the pipe, the close pipe is being cut into two, two pieces of equal length. So I cut this uh, close pipe into two pieces. So what do you expect? This length cut into two pieces. That means each of them is half length, half length, isn't it? Half length, half length. And I'll, I also will end up with only one closed pipe. Another one is surely an open pipe. Uh, because it's like you cut in the middle. You see? You cut in the middle like this. Uh, so this part, the left hand side, become a closed pipe. The right hand side is an open pipe. Uh, because it has two open ends. Okay? And he says that what is the frequency of the fundamental mode of each piece? That means for each piece, also we want to find out the fundamental mode. Fundamental mode for each piece. So for each piece, uh, this is how it, the fundamental mode looks like. Okay? Uh, because he say want the fundamental mode of each, of each piece. That means I want the fundamental mode of the new closed pipe. And also fundamental mode of the new open pipe. Okay, so the close pipe fundamental mode is always node with empty node. And for the open pipe is always empty node with empty node. Because for the open end, it always empty node. Okay, because the air there can vibrate freely. Uh, so both of these are fundamental mode. Okay, so what's the frequency of them? What's the frequency of this fundamental mode? Uh, very easy. So the new length is half length. Uh, this half length is equal to one quarter lambda. Okay, let's continue. This half length is equal to one quarter of the lambda. One quarter of the lambda. So, let's find out the lambda. 
Uh, so uh, this simplify, we get 2. So this is lambda is equal to 2L. Lambda equal to 2L. Now we just use the formula V equal to F. Sorry. V equal to F lambda. Uh, so let's find out the frequency for this. V over lambda. Okay, V. Uh, uh, and then la this lambda is uh, 2L. Just substitute with 2L. Uh, 2L. Ah, so I here I got the ratio V over L here. Do you see that? Uh, so the v, I can utilize this one V over L. Uh, v over L is substitute here. Uh, I substitute there. Uh, half times V over L. V over L is uh, 1648. Uh, 1648. So what's the answer? I got it for 824 hertz. Uh, that's the, fun, the fundamental frequency. The fundamental frequency for the close pipe. Uh, for the close pipe. Okay. For the new close pipe. Uh, okay. For the new close pipe. New close pipe. Now, uh, for the second one, the open pipe, the open pipe, so do the same thing, okay? So this one, half L, is equal to how long? How? Between anti node if anti node is half lambda, okay? Between anti node if anti node is half lambda, and between node and anti node is one quarter lambda, between anti node with anti node is half lambda, okay? Half lambda. So yes, we can uh, cut off, uh, and then we can get the lambda, which is equal to L, and then V equal to F lambda. Uh, we can get a frequency for this, V over lambda, and then um, V over L, V over L. Yeah, V over L, V over L, I got it just now. V over L is 1648, isn't it? 1648. Uh, so. The answer of the frequency for this open pipe is 1648. Isn't it? Uh, yeah, 1648 hertz. Yeah, this is the new for the new open pipe. The frequency for the new open pipe. Is that correct? Yeah, fu fundamental frequency for each piece is 1648 and 824. Yeah, 1648 for the open pipe, 824 for the closed pipe. Okay, so very simple, yeah? Remember, just remember to draw the diagram. From there, you get uh, the, length of the, the length of the pipe in terms of lambda. And then you apply V equal to F lambda. Yeah, V equal to F lambda to find the frequency. And you can find for all. Okay, just remember to... To know the shape of the fundamental mode, uh, then you are good to go, yeah? Okay? So that's all, and see you in the third questions.